Okay, this is lab 15, configuring trusts. We are working our way through the lab manual, configuring advanced Windows Server 2012 services R2. This is part of the Microsoft Official Academic Course Lab Manual in preparation for exam 70-412. During this lab, we're going to look at creating and configuring a one-way external trust. We'll also be looking at creating and configuring a two-way forest trust and then validating and testing a trust. All right, so in this first exercise, we're going to create a one-way external trust between Contoso domain and the adatum.com domain. So we're going to start by logging into the RWDC01 as Contoso administrator using, the pass using our standard password. Okay, we're going to go into Tools, and then DNS, and then click on Conditional Forwarders, and New Conditional Forwarder. Now here we're going to type in the DNS domain, adatum.com. And then put in the IP address. And then click on OK. Now we want to go into the storage machine. Again, click on Tools. Now I'm already logged in as uh, a datum slash administrator. Tools and DNS. Expand storage and left click conditional forwarders and then right click new conditional forwarder. And here we're going to type in contoso.com. And we're going to put in the 192.168.1.50, which is the IP address for our DNS. Then OK. Now we're going to go back into Tools, Active Directory Domains and Trusts on the RWDC01.
Now we want to put in our username and password for the administrator. And next, we're going to keep it as domain wide. And then next again under trust selection complete. And then next, and we want to do yes to confirm the outgoing trust. And then next, and then finish. And then OK. And then OK. And that is the end of this exercise, um, but leave everything open for the next exercise.